Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. My name is Ruffy and today we'll be doing day 6 of 12 days of breeding. Today we are trying to get some mealy bays. Remember to comment, like, and subscribe. My name is Ruffy's support channel. I really appreciate it if you did. And yes, so today, mealy bays. <laughs> yeah, I'm here with Haley. I've been racing with her today. She's pretty epic. Um, but yes, yeah, so I recently I just got rid of the two chestnut sabinos because I was recording, um, and I didn't realize I wasn't recording in my voice. So yeah, we got rid of the two chestnut sabinos we got from the chestnut sabino video. Um, we got this horse. I don't know when we got this horse. Uh, I think we I can't remember when we got this horse, but we definitely got this during the 12 days. Um, but yes, uh, but yeah, I don't know. I'll get rid of it. There's no reason to keep it really is there because i could use it for the chestnut for the guys guys <laughs> for the uh fucking black sabino video but i don't know whatever we'll keep it if we need to or not anyway but yeah so today we're doing melee bays and the thing is if i get a melee bay that's really pretty and has good stats i will keep that <laughs> i will keep it <laughs> but the thing is do i want to try to breed a speed melee bay because I will definitely use a speed melee bay. But I don't know if I want... Do I want a 120s melee bay, you know? Because... Alright, let's see. We have Levi here. And Levi is my speed racing horse. Uh, he's my speed like magic racing horse. So, it, he, but he's not got 120 speed, which sucks ass. So we could use him... To try to breed a 120 speed melee melee bay, that I think is a good plan because we can get rid of him. No, I love Levi as much as the rest of them, but uh, he's not the prettiest. <laughs> also, I'm not the I'm not that emotionally attached to him anyway, so I don't think anyone's going to be disappointed if I get rid of him. <laughs> um, but yes, yeah. Anyway, so we're going to do this. Da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. I don't usually breed uh, speed, so I don't even know that there's gonna be melees in speed. Look how small he is. He's so little. Oh, but I love melee bays. I think they're adorable. Nope, we're gonna be breeding speeds. Uh, let's just see what we've got. Three pages? Not the worst. <laughs> and we're looking just for good stats, really. It'd be lovely if we could get. Ooh, this horse is great, actually. We don't have a lot of good lineages, though. But this guy, this one's plus five, S and he's got good stats. But his his t his main kind of success, I don't know. We'll breed with this guy. Uh, yeah, and maybe this guy as well. My favorite is full. Who the heck is even on here? This guy's always on here. Well, I brought I brought him in the buckskin video, and that was eons ago. Now where's who am I breeding? This guy, this guy. All right. Uh, let's go for rhinestone. Epically. But yeah, what do you guys think of melee bays? I really like melee bays. I think they're really cute. People say they look like donkeys, but I don't care. I mean, I think they're cute, so... I guess the donkeys are cute. <laughs> uh, I mean, I want to get, like, um, a long mane, long tail, or curly mane, curly tail piston. He's, he's meowing at me. He's screaming at me, my cat. Um... <laughs> A melee bay, but preferably brown mane. I think the brown mane's look best on him, so I don't know if breeding black mane is the best way to go about this. But I don't know. But anyway, um, let's hope we get one. I don't want this to end up like yesterday. Oh my god, in yesterday's video, I literally rage quit. I was so... I was so upset. Like, I was so unnecessarily upset, you know? <laughs> I've not gotten uh, upset at Alicia breeding in a while. Ooh, this is good stats. Shit, everything else. I mean, actually, like, shit looking horse, but pot and good stats. Like, this is what we want. This is what we want, but we want it to be a pretty mealy bay. Is that too much to ask for? Yeah, you're kind of nasty. Um, but yeah, no, I actually genuinely was very upset. <laughs> and so I was just like, fuck it. But no, I hardly ever get ma upset at breeding, honestly. I've not got upset at breeding in a long time. But now it's only been one day. But yeah. Oh. Sorry. Oh, two pots in a row? It's pretty good. Levi's good at giving me pots. Strongheart, uh, we don't really need Strongheart for a speed. Actually, if I had a 120 Strongheart speed horse, that'd be really interesting. Because, um, it probably would have shit pot, though, because... 
past my cat's making a ruckus behind me. Please excuse me, I'm distracted. Because my main speed horse is this horse and they're strong heart. But they're 70 70, so I don't know. It'd be interesting to use a speed horse that's got a strong heart. See, I was actually I was actually playing Alicia earlier today. Can you believe it? I was actually playing this game. Amazing. Um <laughs> I was playing AO, and I was racing, I was racing speed, I was racing with a good, good few people. And I thought, because when I was grading up my chestnut Sabino, I was using a control horse, you know? I think I was also, I might have been using like a weird rental or something, but I was doing shit because I wasn't on my speed horse, my racing horse, and I was like, I was like, oh no, am I bad at this game now? Bro, once I tried my, my speed racing horse, I was legendary once again. <laughs> I, it kind of sucks ass that I'm so reliant on a horse because my old, my old um, guild leader, RG. Shout out to RG. She's amazing. I miss you. Um, I miss I miss our guild. Anyway, um, she would always say like, oh, "Look at that." She didn't say that, but bruh. That's what we need. Different different coat though. God damn it. She'd always say like, oh, if you, it's good to practice on uh, horses that aren't, that don't have pot and stuff because then you hone in your like technique and stuff and you can become better, which is true. But <laughs> Jesus Christ, do I suck without my horse? <laughs> because it is insane what a difference having a good speed horse does, honestly, because this is my speed horse. Um, she's my third speed horse. I've, see, White Pegasus was, actually no, Pure was my first, but I don't have her anymore. Then it was White Pegasus, then it was Moonlight, and then it's Twilight. So it's taking me a good few horses to get to where this is. And she's a 70-70 with a little bit of spirit. I'm sorry. It's spirit, the, the person's spirit is going to be very upset about this. I want it to be exactly 170-70, but I'm stupid. Anyway, don't do this. Whatever. Um, but she's got like 94 strong hearts, so it's really good. Um, I wish it was 100. It's pretty close. <laughs> but anyway, she's like so good to race on oh my gosh i like racing today i wanted to make a video comparing me racing on the, my racing horse compared to me racing on like a 120 control horse because the difference is insane because i mean yeah if anyone wants to get good at speed racing you definitely have to practice we're getting good stats here but not the right code you definitely have to practice and you definitely have to oh my god if I go below 2 million, I'm gonna be so upset. I'm so freaking poor right now. I know a lot of people don't have a million and they're like, what are you talking about? You have over 2 million, bro. But I used to have 5 million and I feel dirt poor right now. But anyway, I'm sorry about I'm saying, uh, you definitely have to practice and like, there's definitely, you definitely know how to like chain boosts. Like chaining boosts, I'd say it's probably one of the most important thing you do in speed. And if you just play speed, like you play magic, where you just use your boost whenever you get one, <laughs> Yeah, it's gonna be a bit you're gonna you're gonna be struggling a little bit but like it's such a difference such a difference especially having a strong heart horse because with strong heart what it does is it makes it so that your gauge gradually fills up over time like a like a little bit um except when you're boosting and so you just get gauge which is so valuable oh my gosh it just makes such a difference uh, a lot of good players. Oh, I was playing with Havo today. I think that's how you pronounce it. H-A-V-O. Anyone who plays speed, you might have seen him around. He's a really good uh, speed. I, I say he. I don't know their pronouns. I'm sorry. I'm just going to assume he. Um, they're a really good speed player. And I was actually like kind of keeping up with them today. And I was like very proud of myself. <laughs> Not going to lie. Um, but no, I was going to ask him what horse stance he used. I'm sure I've asked him in the past. He might use a rezo, like a resourceful horse. A lot of people use resourceful horses. A lot of good players. Bro, we got a chestnut Sabino. Why am I getting every coat except a melee bait? We got Chainmaster. What does Chainmaster even do? I only know what the two. I only know what the speed potentials do, and that that's because there's only two of them. Your shackles stay longer on other players. Oh, that's interesting. I feel like with magic, potentials don't really matter as much. They are definitely a big help. Like, like if you have iron grip, bro, that's the one pot potential I would die to get because, like, iron grip's really good. I think I actually have a horse that has iron grip because iron grip is suck is terrible, though. I think it's wolf. Um, we'll see. 
but no, but like shackles lasting longer, like that, yeah, that's nice, but you don't like need it. But like the speed potentials, bro, these are so fucking OP, especially the old one. Oh, it's Lucifer. Lucifer has iron grip. It's only 30 though. It's kind of shit. And Wolf. Wolf doesn't have anything. Yeah, all my horses have. My my old horses are plagued with down tail thrill. Which is, which is not terrible. It's definitely not a bad one to have. It makes it so that you go faster when running downhill. Um, which is good. It's not, like, game-changing. But it's definitely a nice thing to have, you know? <laughs> but yeah. Bruh! This sucks ass. Please. Alright, uh, let's see. Should be with you, should be with you. Bulldozer. I mean, doesn't he have bulldozer? Maybe we should breed bulldozer or bulldozer. Yeah. Hold on. Yeah. Oh, he's got powerhouse. What's the difference? Less speed, loss. Powerhouse is pretty good. Hmm. Actually, I don't think. The pots don't matter, I think, actually. It, all that matters is that you breed. If you breed two horses together that if both of sorry <laughs> if you breed two horses together and both of them have a pot doesn't matter what it is you'll be more likely to get a potential but the parents potential doesn't influence the foal's potential if that makes sense so if you breed two uh powerhouse horses together it's not going to raise your chances of getting powerhouse it's just going to raise your chances of getting uh, potential, if that makes any sense at all. <laughs> I think so. Alright. Oh, wait, Miss has got plus nine. Come on, baby. Please give me a melee bait. I would, I really want a melee bait that I can keep because I love Levi, I'm not gonna lie, but I never use him because I don't, I don't play magic. <laughs> uh, Magic is kind of boring. I'm I'm people who know me. I've I've said this a bazillion times, but I don't really play magic that much. I have not seriously played magic uh, in like years. There was cuz when I first started playing Alicia, I actually started out playing speed racing because speed racing has the advanced courses, you know? And I thought these advanced courses are so fun. I'm going to keep playing them cuz I thought it was like cool that you could like go in different parts and stuff. Of course that was shit. I didn't know what I was <laughs> doing when I first started out. And then I think I, at like, you can see on my old videos, um, like when I used to play with Pudge and stuff, I used to play on, uh, da -da 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 -da, match, uh, speed I'm pretty sure. But then I started playing Magic for whatever reason. I don't know. I don't even know how long I played Magic. I think I started playing Magic when I started breeding 120 horses. I'm guessing. I don't really know. I can't really remember to be perfectly honest. Um, but yeah, I must have because I was breeding control horses. Unless I was playing, I might have been playing speed while riding a control horse because I didn't know what anything did, bro, to be honest. But anyway, I played magic for a while and then I was like, y'all, magic's kind of boring. So I thought, I'm gonna try to learn speed and just like learning to play speed was really interesting to me. And we got a blue roan. I, I feel like every other day we've gotten a blue roan. And it's a pretty blue run. Ooh, is this gonna be my new speed horse? Hold on, what are we naming this? Let's let me scour the Discord. Let me see what we're who 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 we gonna name this after. I gotta make sure I don't re name people, <laughs> name two horses after the same person. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna name this horse Mortal because I think they joined today. I could be wrong. What did you? Join? Yeah, they joined today, and they've been talking. So Mortal, hell yeah. Mortal. Epic. Um, but yeah. Oh, shit! Yeah, you're my new- you're my new speed horse. <laughs> Not got a potential, though, but do I care? Spirit, let me know down below if this really matters. Is- should- is keeping Levi, who's not even 120 speed, worth keeping over Mortal here? And I- I wanna keep a- I wanna keep a blue run, so we're gonna- we're gonna keep this. We're gonna keep this horse. Unless we get a better melee bait. If we get if we get a melee bait, then we're gonna have a tough decision on our hands. I'll tell you what. Um, but if I end up keeping Mortal here, I'll use Mortal to 
breed um, for another blue roan uh, when we bleed for when we breed for blue roans on Christmas, so that we can possibly get a better one, so we can get one with like a better tail or one with pot. That that's the plan. Because I would like to breed horses with different stats. Because uh, let me tell you, I have so many control horses; it's ridiculous. And I don't even play magic. Like, look at this, Frederick. I never use Frederick, but I keep him because he's cute, and we love him. Levi has some actual use, you know. That's why if I was ever going to get rid of a horse to clear up space, it would probably be Wolf or Moonlight. But, uh, they're not Moonlight. Moonlight, because Moonlight's my old speed horse, and I, as you can see, she's not as good as, she's not as good as uh, Twilight. But I haven't gotten, I haven't, I haven't brought, I don't have the courage to get rid of Moonlight yet, because I'm quite emotionally attached to her. I made an edit for her a while ago, uh, like ages ago actually. Um, it was called Lullaby for a Moonlight. I love the edit. It's so pretty. I edited it to um, uh, the Lullaby, uh, Isabella's Lullaby, I think it's called, from what's that anime called? Oh, what's it called? Prom the Promised Neverland. It is such a pretty song. Oh my god, I love it. And I was like, I'm gonna make a, I'm gonna make a little edit for my horse because, eh, why not? You know, um, and it's good and I love it and it's pretty. And it was funny because like when you watch the edit, it seems like she died or something. <laughs> Cause it's like it's a very somber edit. Um, but after like shortly after I made that video, I got Twilight. So you know maybe I'll be getting rid of her, uh, Moonlight anyway. Oh, look at that. It's a black pinto. Are you are you guys em as emotionally invested uh, into your horses as I am? Because <laughs> I feel like people are emotionally attached to their horses. Uh, that's the word to say. The phrase to say. Emotionally attached. Um, but like, I feel like... I mean, I've been having my... I've had Cedric and Luna since 2017, 2018. You know, I've had these these horses for a long ass time <laughs> so i think my me being emotionally attached to them is um understandable but yeah, let me know if you guys are emotionally attached to your horses and why and what do they look like tell me tell me in the comments i'm curious like i'm emotionally attached to my horses just because i've had them for so goddamn long and i love them <laughs> i don't know i guess it's hard to explain why isn't it I mean, like, I kept Luna because she was my first ever good horse ever. And I just, like, never got rid of her. I don't know why. And now I, like, can't get rid of her. You know, I, I, I can't get rid of my grandma, Glass Horse. I call her my Glass Horse because every time I race on her, she gets injured so quickly. <laughs> oh, my gosh. And then I can't get rid of Cedric because he's, he's, he's Cedric. Look at him. He's, like, my mascot. He's just my mascot as much as my avatar is. He's in, like, all my profile pictures and stuff. I, I don't know. I don't know when Cedric became my favorite horse. Like Cedric's my favorite horse out of my whole my horses, and I don't know when that happened, but it just kind of did happen. And he is, so you know, we love most being emotionally attached to um, horses. <laughs> Actually, for Christmas, I've been tr I've been wanting to get some horse figurines. You know, like I'm not I don't I'm not a collector or anything. I definitely haven't collected we got another blue what is this video we've not gotten one mealy bait i wanted a mealy bait and all we're getting is fucking blue runes over here uh we're not gonna keep this bad boy i just realized we should put up our other blue run that's big silly what do you look like no you're not worth keeping i should probably get rid of firefly do i want to get rid of firefly it's either i breed yeah, no, we're gonna get rid of you because I'm, I think I'm gonna use Firefly for the Black Sabina video because yes, I do have Luna here, but look at her stats 34 spirit. What the hell? <laughs> Why does she have 34 spirit? She's crusty. I'm sorry. I love her, but she's Absolutely crusty. Also, I just realized uh, we're gonna have to get rid of Levi at some point because I just replaced him Oh, Levi. Time to make a sad edit for Levi. <laughs> oh, man. Wait, should I be... No, I keep breeding with Levi. Um, okay. I'm gonna breed a couple more times. Like, two more times. 
Yeah, I'm losing so much money with these 12 days of Christmas, bro. But I, I, it was expected. Oh, I mean, we're only halfway through and I've probably spent around 700k, I think. Not even spent, that's how much I've lost. <laughs> so if, if this continues, I'm definitely gonna be below 2 million. Let's hope that the fucking New Year's gift boxes are gonna be good this year because <laughs> I need it. <laughs> I'm, I'm becoming poor. I have to breathe strategically again. Oh man. Look at this, just gosh. What is his name also? Hello? Can someone tell me in the comments how to pronounce this? <laughs> Does anyone know? Did did the devs just like fucking spam their keyboard and were like, yeah, yeah, that's good. Hello, Nightmare. I don't want to join your race. I'm sorry. I was debating it for a second, but I just realized it's probably going to be, it's probably going to be uh, magic. People always, people tend to invite me to the races, and I'm like, oh yay, a race, and then it's magic, and I'm like, oh, <laughs> I'm sorry, I just don't like magic, okay? I find it very dull, especially when, like, I'm streaming and stuff. When I used to stream, people would be like, let's play magic, and I'm like, no, <laughs> it's not fun. Also, people, like, spirit and stuff, people, like, my friends and things who hang out, uh, who... Like my mods and stuff. We all play magic uh, speed as well, so you know. Anyway, I'm probably gonna leave that there. Can't believe we got a blue roan. Who would have thought? So I'll do what I did early. Oh my god, look how small this horse is. Why are you so little? Where is he? Where is he? Mortal, you are male. Um, apparently. <laughs> oh, he's so small! Look at Moon. Oh my gosh. Luna's my tallest horse. Let's see how. Oh. My god, mortal, you are tiny! You are so small! Small boy. Oh my goodness. Um, uh, anyway. Can't believe we got this. Upset we didn't get a melee bay. Two days in a row. Two days in a row, and we didn't get the coat we're going after. What is this? And it's a melee bay! Like, what? Ridiculous. Uh, yeah, Saws fam. I would keep reading just till we get one, but... Uh, my money. We do have to keep some money. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'm gonna leave it there, folks. Thank you all so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know what y'all think about stuff. I don't know. <laughs> in the comments. And, uh, yeah. I will see you all tomorrow. We'll, we'll be breeding. What are we gonna breeding? Hold on, let me check. We'll be breeding. Oh, Rose tomorrow. Very exciting. Hope to see you all then. And I'll see y'all later. Bye, guys!